All right, so during the past few days, there have been a few leaks that have been tagged in that console was going to actually come out with the custom custom button binds, and they ended up doing it. This is uh, brand new with Season 6, and let's uh, pull up the patch notes real quick. All right, so in the gameplay section, second thing down, custom controller bindings. Uh, it says choosing your configuration has changed to a selector on the side on the left side of the menu. After selecting custom, the right side of the menu becomes buttons that are selectable. When buttons are clicked, it opens a list of actions that can be assigned to that button. Uh, mode selection, combat build is changed to selectable by triggers. You rotate through them with the triggers. Uh, when in either combat or build mode, the actions for that mode and the actions that span between modes will appear in the actions list. Another cool thing is they did console input based matchmaking. So. Uh, players that plug in a keyboard and mouse to their PS4 will actually queue up with PC people now, which is pretty cool. So, uh, this is what it looks like. You go to uh, your your settings. There's a little little bar on the left side where you can choose old school quick, but all the old settings, and then you get a custom one, and then you click it, and then you can base it off of. So you you click on you click custom. And then uh, I'd have to reset it to do it. But it, it asks you, do you want the old school Quick Builder, Combat Pro, or Builder Pro settings? So it'll base it off of that, and it'll do all those settings. And then you can customize it. And so I did it based off Builder Pro. And then I actually, I've been doing this for like an hour, like trying to figure out the best thing to do. I'm choosing to edit with the, the middle button this middle this just big pad but I still have so I kept it on circle to like switch to editing mode and also hold circle to to edit too so I have you I have two ways to edit basically and you can use it for different things because sometimes it's easier to just use circle sometimes it's much easier to actually use the pad but yeah I just switched the map with with my uh, right on the d-pad and uh, it's actually unbound in the build controls which is fine i'll show you why i chose it i was thinking about also editing with uh right tr the right thumbstick clicking it in but that didn't really work out uh but anyways okay so the reason i chose editing with the with the uh map button or the the big pad is because okay so well first of all look at it it's it's literally instant you can just you can pull out editing and put it away. But anyways, when you're sprinting, your your hand goes up or your your thumb goes up and it like literally you can touch the pad when you're sprinting. So see, I'll place this and I can just I don't even have to let up on the thumbstick. I just push up and I can I can uh, start the edit and it's like actually really simple. So let's just say there's a bunch of builds. You like you're just kind of running around and you can just like you can just quick do it and it looks like PC speed. Like it's honestly insane how fast you can edit with this. Cause it, I mean, it is this, it's now the speed of PC. It's a little bit difficult because it, it, it just feels weird. Uh, learning cause it's really just learning new keybinds. But I think once you really get used to it, it's going to be really useful. All right. I'm going to try something. I'm going to try the, this like editing tower on, it's with a controller, so it's going to be weird, but I should be able to do it pretty fast. Let's get used to this. Ah. Uh. Okay, that was like, like decent at best, but I'm still getting it down. But anyways, this is uh, pretty dope that they actually did something like this because now you can just edit so fast and it's, it's going to take some time getting used to it. But I, but I think these are the best settings 
I at least for my personal preference. Um, let's see. I'm gonna see how I can get used to this and actually using it in game. But anyways, thanks for uh, watching, and I will see you guys later.